Missouri has legalized recreational marijuana, of course, but decisions still loom about whether or not to tax those sales at a local level. Our Alex Simone tells us more. St. Joseph voters will decide during April's election whether to add a local 3% tax to any recreational marijuana sales. St. Joseph Councilman Michael Grimm says the hope is that it would be a significant boon for the city, but the actual benefit remains unknown. We have no idea what kind of money it's going to bring in. Uh, it, it may bring in a very little bit and it may bring in a lot. So I think that's where we have to wait and see uh, before we can make any commitments. The city estimates the tax would generate $100,000 to $150,000 in revenue. The city estimates the tax would generate $100,000 to $150,000 in revenue that would be added to the city's general fund. St. Joseph City Manager Brian Carter says it's important to err on the side of caution in terms of projection. The only thing we're really looking at as a, a guidepost for now is our past history with medical marijuana sales. Um, the, the regulation of marijuana, even in legalized states, uh, differs quite a bit across, across states. So it's of limited value to look at other states and try to project revenue. Especially since the proposal has yet to be voted on. But Grimm says it can be difficult to keep from looking ahead at all the different places the money can be used if the proposal passes. There's uh, some really good groups that are working right now uh, to clean up the city. But that they need help with trash bags and grabbers and gloves and all that. That might be a direction. Uh, there are so many directions that, that I think have been neglected in the past. The decision will be voted on during the April 4th general municipal election. Alex Simone, News Press Now.